Hello, my friends, and welcome to a new game, in which I pretty much um, did a bit of testing. And this game came out quite recent. And this is technically a 10th anniversary game of a familiar series. One in which um, is the harder of the two in the Koei Warriors series. So without further ado, I hope and pray that the following video will come through the way I wanted to come through since I had to tweak it a bit with with um whatever I had to do. So without further ado <coughs> Yes, I played it for this long. So without further ado, let's start up this bad boy and see if it swims. Yes, this is Samurai Warriors 4-2. <clears throat> And Samurai Warriors has a very short history of its games, but it's been around for about 10 years. This is the 10th anniversary game, and the history goes back as far as the PlayStation 2 with this game. Now, the first games were on the PlayStation 2. 1 and 2, along with Extreme Legends, were on the PlayStation 2 as well. There was an Empires game. And... There were two on the Wii. One is one is called um, Samurai Warriors Katana, in which you just use the Wii mode as basically your weapon of choice, being your katana. I actually have that game along with the sequel to Samurai Warriors 2, 3. And Samurai Warriors 3 was pretty much the best game I could ever try on the Wii because I basically played the hell out of it, and I regret nothing out of my decision. Four, in this case, this is for two. Four came out on the PS3, and I, I think also the Xbox One. And four two is basically the sequel of four. Oh, I think it's on Vita two. But 4-2, if, if you have a PS3 or a Vita, and you have data on it, you can piggyback off it, and you can get extra bonuses. However, I don't have a Vita nor a PS3, nor would I want one. 
I mean, it's nice and all, but you know, don't don't really care for it. So, excuse me. My back history with this game is that I've been tweaking it. I've been tweaking it to see if I can make it work or not because it, the cutscenes kind of like gave me hell. So before I actually, so before we actually get into it, I'm actually gonna do this. Okay, so if I do that, okay. I don't know about the texture filter, so hold on. I'm not gonna mess with the frame rate because I don't know. But just for just for safety's sake, this is what I did. Basically put it on low quality. So hopefully, if I put it to low and standard, I think we'll be okay. Oh, and I also have been putting some time into some of my created characters. Like, well, this is mine. Well, these are my four. You can have up to 20 slots for your created create character. Unlike Dynasty Warriors, unlike Dynasty Warriors, which is up to like eight now, especially with the um, Empires games, the Empires games you can have up to shit, almost endless amounts of characters. So it's like the whole the whole the, the ideas are kind of endless. I could probably make the RCO at this rate if I wanted to. So of course this is some of the characters I made. This is mine. <laughs> Based off me. Tonoso Man Nigo, or Tonoso Man number two. Basically, imagine if the Steel Samurai actually had a, a son. It's going to give you an idea. And then we have Ryuhi, which, um... I technically based him off of the Hiro no Ken series. I try to make him as close to the actual character as I possibly can. Never use him yet. I'll probably put him through, um... Like, free mode or survival. See how that goes. Momohime or the Pink Princess. Again, try to... Again, I try to base it off of the characters from the Vintage Wright series. Try to make it as close to the characters as possible. But I think I might might get some DLC, some edit packs, just to get more to choose from out of this because that's all I can that's all I could possibly come out of that. And then we got the vault, just so you can view the view events, music, and such. You got the your tutorials, we already went through settings. So of course, let me go through all, all these. We got survival mode. Basically, survival mode is just you going through a tower of 100 floors, you have to survive all 100 floors if you can. It's a great place to grind if you really do need to grind. 
for extra care, you know, for your characters and whatnot. You can actually unlock certain characters when you go through challenge mode, because there's standard and there's challenge. When you go through standard, you're going through the 100 floors from start to finish until you die. Challenge, though, challenge actually has you doing three different three different challenges. Well, actually four. But the only way you can actually get the fourth challenge is you have to score an A rank on the following three challenges that you do. So, um, I'll, I'll just run this out. If you get the first challenge, if you if you net the first challenge right up, right off the bat, I believe you unlock Miyamoto Musashi. If you beat the second challenge, you will unlock Goemon Ishikawa. If you beat the third challenge, you will unlock Kojiro Sasaki, otherwise known as Mus Musashi's rival. I don't know what you would get if you unlock the the fourth challenge, because you have to score an A rank on the other three challenges first before you get the fourth challenge. And the fourth challenge is basically the hardest of all four challenges. Free mode is basically just that. You play any stage you want with any character of your liking, whether it be created or who's in the lineup. So, that's a good thing. Ah, uh, story mode. I've only tried one of the stories. And the one story I had problems with was Clash of Wills. So, what I might do... Is I might try something else. I, I will not try Clash of Wills first. I'll probably try something else. Which I think that's a good idea. Just to see if my, um my tweaking proof useful in this recording. So let's start up story mode. And of course, this is probably the only game, the only game in the series that actually supports online co-op. But since I'm recording this at 4 in the morning, I don't see anybody online to play online co-op with. So, let's see. We got one player. Two player split screen. That's local co-op. And two player network multiplayer. That's online co-op. I'm not going to highlight them because I'd rather just tell you what they are. So you have local co-op and online co-op. Since, we, since I have no partner next to me or online at this moment, we're going to play this single player. So, we have 14 stories, but so far we only have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Five stories already, um, already ready for us. So we have Clash of Wills. The only one I, I believe I have problems with because of the cutscene. The story cutscene, not the not the um not the not like the um movie cutscene, but it's probably the story cutscene. And I don't think there's a way you could and I don't think there's a way you can actually, you know, skip past it. So I'm gonna see if I can try something else. Next one is the trials of trust. The third is Sparks of Rebellion. The fourth is Love and Fear. And the fifth, for the moment, is Visions of, of Hope. Now, of course, the first one is about Naomasa E, which is the new the newest character in the um, Samurai Warriors line of. Um, series. As long as I'm counting, it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 
7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So that's 13 stages. Okay. 13 stages in which um, there's going to be 5 five apiece, I believe. Because I believe the full... There, there's going to be four stages. How, how it is with the Samurai Warriors games are you get four stages and the fifth one is a dream stage. So basically you're going through the main storyline throughout four stages but the fifth one is basically a dream. So it's more like a what if. So you got four historical and one what if. So we can play them in any order. So actually I'm going to do something different. I'm going to start with <clears throat> I mean this one <coughs> This one's all about um Iyasu. This one's about the son of the clan. This one's about Nobunaga. This one is about um the new another of the newest characters, Koshosho. And Maguchi Saika is part of it, and of course, this one has Mitsunari Ishida in it. So we're gonna go with the Sanada first. Hopefully, this will work out in my favor. So let's go through this. Nobuyuki Sanada is responsible for protecting the legacy of the Sanada. What trials and tribulations? What trials and tribulations await this man, and with deep ties to his younger brother? Yukimura Sanada and a beautiful Ina. Kakugo was Tata. Zutto Maikara. Ieo Mamoro to Sru Aniga. Tamashi O Mamoro to Sru Toto Gaida. Son of Tari. Kizna O Mimamur Hime Gaida. Lanceva Totsen. Kareda ni Kakokura gets down with Skiske. Ani, Sanada no Bukiga. Erabu is to. Okay, so like I said, I'm, go I'm actually going to do something different instead of going through the first thing, which is I go through this, and then we, instead of going through Namasa E, we're just going to Sanada. The first battle of Ueda Castle. It's a one star difficulty. An encounter on the battlefield changes Nobuyuki's destiny forever. Repel the massive Tokugawa army that's approaching the castle. And we're gonna play this in the normal. Not normal, what's wrong with me? Easy. Just because levels. Need them levels. Sasuga Tokugawa. Taigun da. Naga. Hashiba kara mitsunari. Whoa! Let us your son of the Nobiki. Go some male. Oh, that's
真田家はこれを良しとせず徳川から離反上杉と組徳川家康に対抗する構えを見せる真田の軍略と友の力を携えて真田信行雪,雪村の若き兄弟は徳川の大軍に挑んだ。第一次上田城の戦い。Dixie! Ah,、oh, good. We actually got through that. Okay, character selection. In story mode, you can select a primary character and a secondary. At the select character screen, you can use the switch to. Switch characters during battle. Take stock of the battle situation. Make wise use of character switch to progress in battle in your favor. So, our primary is Nobuyuki Sanada. And our secondary, our choice of either Yukimura, Kunochi, Mitsunari Shida, Sakonshima. Kanetsugu Naoe and Kagikatsu Usui. Well, of course, I'm going to go with the brother because, you know, brothers guys stick together, you know. And you can also change their costumes if you, if you so choose to. So, basically, we're going through mainly all of the、um, Son of the Clan and their members. So, let's do this thing. Alright, let's do this thing. Okay, we have our equipment. And we have mounts. Now, mind you, when I was doing all that, when I was doing all that testing, I actually got a. Well, actually, no. I actually got these when I, when I pre ordered these. So I got a lot of pre orders. Mainly, I got something like.、Um, I got all these extra added. Extra added character.、Um, well, you know, extra added mounts and whatnot. So, Ashen Wind is going to be my accelerated mount. And of course, this is a new feature that was. That was introduced since Samurai Wars 4. Acquire skills. Now, if you look at this correctly, it kind of reminds you of Final Fantasy X's、um, tree. Because when you go through this, you know, you unlock one, and, you know, you unlock one, this happens, this happens, and you unlock, when you, when you unlock one trait, you get more traits. So it's like you unlock one branch, a few more just pop up in this place. So I don't, so you need strategy tunes for this. No. So let me go for Ash and Wind Resilience. So. It doesn't matter who you start off with, you'll, you'll both be working the same way. You're working as a team instead of、um, basically one character. I think, I think, actually, Chronicles actually started that. Samurai Warriors Chronicles actually started the switch out. Because all you have to do is basically say, oh, I want you here. It's like, oh, this person's here? Okay, I want to be with this person instead of that person. So, let's see. Yin Yang Blades and Aeon Spear. We're good. We're good. Let's, let's begin the battle. So, our victory conditions are defeat Tokugawa Ieyasu. And either Masayuki or Nobuyuki Sanda are defeated, is our defeat condition. So, 
Let's begin the battle, shall we? Okay, our objective is to defeat Tadatsugu Sakai, Chikayoshi Hiraiwa, and Tanamasa Tori. I don't think you would, man. I don't think you would. Hey, brother! Okay, next is to defeat Yatsura, Yatsutara Shibata and Nagamori Okabe before Naotoi E breaks through the secondary ward North Gate. Bonus objective! Defeat Dao defeat Naomasa E and Yasumasa Saki Sakaki Bara and prevent Yukishige Yokuyu Yokuya from being defeated. Okay, we can do that. Yes, you will actually run into these. And the more you do these bonus objectives, it's, it's like more it is for you.
you want to switch. Oh, ho, 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 nice. Get the hell out of here. and the Ninja Masters. In that case, switch! Level increase! Objective! Ensure that Nobuyuki Sanada defeats Ina. Oh, 
we're done. Shigemetsu Honda and Moritsuna Watanabe from crossing the Kamikawa River. Sanada, Kanetsugu Naoe, and Mitsunari Shida over half full. They could do that. Oh, you're done. Done! Oh shit, it's Tadakatsu! Bring it, Tadakatsu! Get your ass down here! I want every bit of whatever bonus there is as whole battle. Oh, 
いじったのかえー、次about the wrong time. I got mainly all the bonus, the bonus objectives. I didn't get this one because that's locked for some reason. It's like, we got everything, just about. And behold, that's how you can actually gain like a good amount of levels. Just, just like that. Just like that. And behold, all your stats grow the more you level. So we get all these balls, so... Damn. <laughs> That's a lot. I like... I like that a lot. Dad first, right? I have to go through her dad first, right? Um, yeah, I I gotta go through her dad first. Righteous encounter. Mitsunari Dono, Karetsugu Dono, Gojoroku, Kansha Itashimas. Leina Dono, Muyo, Warena wa Gino Doshi, Askea Dono, Tosenda, Na, Mitsunari. Orewa Doshi Nata, Oboe Wanai, Tomo Ware, 
徳川を撃退できてよかった家康の存在は秀吉様にとって邪魔にしかならない雪村お前たち真田はこれからも徳川を牽制してくれ You know, I simply love the fact that, you know, you actually seeing the characters talk instead of like. Like you actually see the characters talking besides seeing their portrait. You know, that, that's a definite plus in this game. Oh, this is a definite plus in this game. Oh, Conan Sugu. I always loved your version the best. And like I said, like I said, um, there are two versions of him, and the one I don't like is the Sengoku Basura version of. Uh, Kanetsugu, because he's basically a joke of his, of his Koei self. I'm pretty sure he's like, Will you shut up? Yukimura, <laughs> So, we've actually unlocked something. We actually unlocked another stage. It's a two star difficulty. And this one is called The Conquest of Odawara. But you know what? I think I'm going to do that for another time. So, stay tuned when we actually jump into. Trials of Trust, Chapter uh, 2, The Conquest of Ottawa. When Samurai Warriors 4-2 continues right after this.